Probably not surprising, but interesting. Stu Brum is an actor, key grip, and owner of Sparta Grip. He joins us tonight. Stu, thanks so much for coming on. So you've seen this. I mean, the rest of us would, I guess, assume that a lot of actors who are, of course, against the Second Amendment probably don't know a lot about guns. But you're saying you have seen actors mishandle firearms. Yeah, uh, thanks for having me on, first of all, Tucker. Of I appreciate it. Um, but uh, yeah, in my industry, you know, we, we deal with a lot of firearm scenarios. Obviously, we've got a lot of Hollywood people that uh, will vilify, fire, vilify firearms and then end up on their TV shows and movies and uh, glorify them in those instances. <laughs> and, you know, yes. it's just the hypocrisy of it. Um, you know, I kind of, you know, I try and be professional on set, but you, you run into those instances where you've watched somebody, you know, make statements on their. TV shows or their, you know, their interviews and, and then you see them on the sets working and they're, you know, trying to be, you know, uh, using the firearms. Uh, it's just, just comical. Well, it's a, it's a, it's a little weird, um, that people who think guns are evil would be, as you said, glorifying their use, playing the tough guy, you know, pointing guns right. in people's faces on the set. I mean, have you ever seen an actor decline a role? Because it involved guns, uh, I'm sure the paychecks far outweigh their, uh, you know, far outweigh their uh, their feelings towards firearms. So um, I guess it goes without saying that a lot of these are people who really just don't know anything about firearms. That's correct. I mean, you, you know, you see them have these conversations on the news channels and with politicians and everything else about firearms, and then you know you hear things. I mean, I grew up around guns. I grew up in Montana. I'm an avid outdoorsman. I'm, I've been yep. hunting my entire Me life too. and. You know, you, you, you hear them talk about uh, firearms and, and they totally don't understand even the me mechanics of them to begin with. Yes. And they're trying to make their, their point across of why they're so bad and evil and everything else. And, you know, honest, hardworking, you know, citizens that, you know, love, love guns. And, you know, my guns have never harmed anybody or never been in the hands of anybody that would do harm. And, um, you know, you just look at those scenarios and then you're, you kind of have to keep quiet on these movie sets and end up working with these individuals. And, and not just you, I've you know, been on a, you know, lots of different sets and there is this huge divide between the people who are getting paid the most and who are on camera and then everybody, the, the army of people off camera who you never see, I would say the majority of whom don't share the politics of the people on camera. Has that been your experience? Absolutely not. I, I, you know, in, my, in my industry, you know, there's always the, you know, the conversations behind the camera and you know, I think a lot of people probably feel very similar to the way that I feel um, when it when it comes to these issues. You yeah. know, uh, but of course we're not making the ten million dollar paycheck, so you know we're just there to do our job and do it to the best of our ability. Well, I for one wish you were making the ten million dollar. <laughs> I do too, Stu. Yeah. Th thanks for joining us tonight. I appreciate it. Thanks for having me. I appreciate it. Subscribe to the Fox News YouTube channel to catch our nightly opens, stories that are changing the world and changing your life. I'm Tucker Carlson tonight.